five tonight. We had one drop out, which is your benefit. So if you have a company, we have room right now, 30 seconds each, for up to 10 companies. Does anybody want to give an elevator pitch about your company or your thing? Um, not an advertisement. Be very clear, not an advertisement. We're not selling anything. We're presenting a company and an idea, okay? Go. 30 seconds, that's good because we're really, really early, way too soon to present anything. The name of our company is Visio Sound. What we are developing right now is an app to help you learn a foreign language and have the correct pronunciation. You're going to have a phone screen in front of you, you're going to have an app, you're going to be able to pull up any sound in any language that you want, and instead of getting oral feedback, you're going to get visual feedback about your pronunciation. It's going to show you how close you are to a target. You're going to pronounce that sound again and again and again until you get closer to your target. And then when you pronounce it like a native speaker, it's going to say you're there and the target's going to explode. We're called Visio Sound and we have the visual accent trainer coming soon, I hope. Hey everybody, my name is Brody Holohan. Um, I run a startup called Verifomics and we do personalized medicine. So we can actually look at your DNA and then make some predictions about you, about how you can change your lifestyle to get healthier now. And what sets us apart from the competition is that we then take our predictions and actually test them in clinical trials. So we have taken this process that takes millions of dollars and months and gotten it down to the cost of electricity on our remote enrollment clinical trial platform so we can give you proven and personalized medical advice for how to improve your health. Do you have any experience? Yeah, I actually have a PhD um, in cancer biology, but there's bioinformatic component of that. Um, and yeah, it's <laughs> all right. A lot of wet lab work. Anyway, awesome. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, everyone. I know a lot of you heard me speak at the last uh, Big DNT, but I was selfishly thought I'd speak at this one, too. <laughs> so, um, Guider, the uh, startup that I founded, many people in the room have been a part of it, is a way to create, share, and discover self-guided experiences built by real people that you already follow and trust. It's been an amazing journey. We just launched our app late November. We got picked up by Product Hunt the day we launched. We got picked up by Killer Startups a couple of weeks later. We've had some awesome traction on downloads. And the reason I'm up here is to tell you that we are going to challenge the Dallas area to create experiences in every district in downtown. There's 16 districts. So if you have an experience to share, please get in touch. Hello at guider.com. Thank you. Hello, I'm Richard Brevik with Expose UX. Wouldn't you love free expert advice on your user experience from experts? Expose UX is a new TV show where user experience experts help startups improve their products. Our experts come from Travelocity, Saber, uh, Project 202, uh, yeah, uh, stuff, a lot, a lot of great things. So uh, we're helping people improve their products. That's it? That's All right. Well, one more. Bring it. All right. My name There you go. My name is um, Laramie. These are one special editions. Um, Laramie, I'm the founder of Dangle. It's a software product for parents to manage their kids' homework, chores, and extracurriculars. There's a re it's a re reward-based platform. So the parents have one side of the app, the kids have another. The parents assign tasks to kids. Kids complete the task, hit a button. Um, parents get a notification that it's done, the kids accrue points, parents redeem the allowance, um, everybody's win. We just signed up our partnership with Highland Park ISD's PTA. We've got some other partnerships coming across the state. Um, we've got some athletes, entertainers on board, so things are looking good. And have you talked to Sarah about pitching here? No. She's right there. <laughs> All right. Anybody else? Nobody else. Oh, come on up. We've got room for a couple more. Hi, my name's Jennifer. I'm coming from Bold Idea. If you know a 5 to 13 year old who's interested in solving community problems, we're starting a program this month as well as in February where we teach kids how to code and apply it to solving the problems they see in the community. It's project-based learning, ages 5 to 13. Um, go to boldidea.org if you're interested. I see another. Yeah, come on up. Come on up. What do you guys think of this? Is this fun? It's pretty fun. All right. Hi everybody, my name is uh, Chintan Sitaria, founder of CalcuQuote. CalcuQuote helps 
Electronics contract manufacturers improve the speed and accuracy of their quote process. Uh, we had the luxury of presenting here a couple months ago, and thanks to the awesome community here, our ask was that we move forward in the Tech Wildcatter application. We're in the next round of whatever it is. Thank you. And we also got some great introductions last time to potential customers, so awesome. Thank you. All right, is that it? All right, we'll do it. Switch screens here. All right, so the next Dallas New Tech, we already have all of the teams selected. Um, so you're gonna see some stuff which is pretty cool. You'll see an announcement tomorrow with all of the teams on it. Um, it is also Groundhog Day, coincidentally, which is February 2nd, also my wedding anniversary. <laughs> Look at that. All right, um, so one of the other things, I just really wanted to make it clear, uh, we really appreciate the work that Roger Wilco and the team does uh, with these videos. There is not another production company that I'm aware of that will do videos like this and have them up the next day. So uh, this is probably, what, nine videos every time we do this, and they knock them out and put them up. So um, they have some tricks to do that, but I can't recommend them enough for your events. If, so um, check that out. They'll be up tomorrow. You can stream them. You can share them. Every team that presented, including these little pitches here, I hope, um, will be available for you to share with your customers and also with your uh, peers. So that's all I have for you tonight. Um, I appreciate everybody being here, and thank you so much for coming. So there is no official after party.